Y'all remember this nest right here with the foxy up ate all 12 eggs out of here? Well, you know, she did nest up on my porch here, and she was successful last year doing that. So I thought, well, maybe I'll go ahead and set her a spot just in case she decides to lay a few more eggs. Well, this is what the planter looked like before. So, well, now, let me go ahead and out here and get some uh, lilies I got in the backyard and put some in one of these and see what she does. Well, look at this. Something's been in here digging. I did put her down in here so she made me feel comfortable knowing what was there and all. But she something has been in here digging. I don't know if it's been her. I don't have any cameras up here. My cameras are all over there. So I'm going to have to set a camera up here and keep an eye on things and see what happens here. If she does come up here and lay them, I'll put some more plants kind of block her view from uh, any predators and maybe fix them up so the fox can't get up here. It's easy anyway. So anyway, look at that. We might have another daisy adventure this year for what's over with. Stay tuned. Well, my little trick to get daisy to come back worked. Check this out right here. She has actually come up in this box I set up for and laid two eggs in it. Got the plants in here to make her feel protected. And this is where she had them last year too. So I thought she might come back here and she did. So she is not giving up. She, uh, she is a determined girl, I can tell you that right now, because uh, she's had a lot of failures here this year. But we'll talk about that in just a second. But I just want to show you right now what it looks like. That's pretty cool, I think. She's getting set up again. So we've got another, she'll probably have 10 eggs, probably got another 8 days at least before she'll start sitting on them. I don't know if she'll get to as many as she had before or not, but we'll see. Well, it looks like Daisy's going to take me up on my new nest offer out there. She's already got two eggs in there, which is really cool. Um, I tell you, she is one persistent duck. She, I know for a fact she failed with nine eggs next door, 12 to 14 out here, and now she's got two more in here. She just keeps going back at it. I tell you, we can learn something from Daisy. If at first she don't succeed, try, try again, right? We interrupt your regularly scheduled Gig Master video for some breaking news. Daisy laid a third egg, but there was a problem. Stay tuned, I'll tell you all about it. All right, in this video right here, we see Daisy making her normal run here to lay an egg in the basket that I set up for her. But the only problem is her backside is outside of the basket. Normally, if she was on the ground, it wouldn't make any difference. But look, if you can see the egg starting to come out, the top left picture there shows it starting to come out. You can see the main picture too. She's having a little hard time getting the egg out. And there it goes. And the egg is out. But it's not in the basket. And she can't lift that egg up. You know, if it was on the ground, like I said, she wouldn't have any problem. But we have a problem now. So I'm going to have to intervene. I normally don't like to mess with uh, nature here too much. You know, as you can see, I do mess with it a little bit trying to provide for but she's looking around now what do i do now i can't lift it up what, what do i do so we're gonna come out right now and give her just a little hand and put it back in the basket let's hope that she comes back to it tomorrow morning all right we got a little problem the daisy dropped the egg out and missed the basket we gotta help her out i just don't try to mess with nature at all but she's got to put this egg back in here she dropped it out. Let's get this egg and put it back in the basket for her. She just dropped it and missed the basket. Look at Daisy. She's out there. I hope she'll come back up and uh, come check it out. She still watches. I just let her come back up. Man, missed the basket. That's a little basket. We now return you to your regular Gigmaster scheduled video. Let's keep our fingers crossed that she shows up tomorrow morning for egg number four. If y'all got something out there you're working on, try it again. Put it down below in the comments. Let me know what it was. And I, I bet you succeed. But anyway, we're going to keep getting up. And uh, we're going to try to help her best we can. we got to let nature take its course. But I will try to put a couple things to deter the fox. Maybe a um, motion-activated light that will cut on when he comes up down below her. To try to help her. We'll try to help her what we can. But we got to let nature take its course. So hopefully, uh, that's two eggs or eight days. Well, she might get put up to, up to 13, they say. So it'd be, and she does one a day, so maybe another 10 days she'll start sitting on them, incubating them. And then we'll uh, be 28 days after that. So sometime in June, we'll, uh, we'll hopefully we'll have us uh, um, walking some ducks down to the water like we did last year, I'm hoping. But 
I'm, I'm, I'm not getting my hopes up too high yet because of, I see what's happened before. So we'll keep an eye on it, dude. Uh, I'm going to end this video with some pictures of Daisy. Uh, what she does is kind of interesting. I, I got a, the video cameras on. You can watch her, how she cleans the nest, goes around looking at things and doing different things while she's getting ready to lay the eggs. She gets in and laying the eggs. These will be pictures while she's... Uh, she, you'll see her, she gets on the ground first and really watches before she goes up to the nest and make sure, I guess somebody's watching where she's going, I don't know. But anyway, uh, check the videos at the end. And don't forget to click like, comment below, share, and subscribe to the Gig Master. Check it out. Check Daisy out.